Hi, I'm Robert Gamblin, founder of Gamblin Conservation Colors. In this video, I would like to discuss earth colors. Earth colors are very important to the painting conservator for the simple fact that so many of the paintings from the first 400 years of oil painting were made with a predominance of earth colors and of course lead white. Earth colors can be easily grouped into two categories, natural and synthetic. The synthetic earth colors uh, come in two varieties, the normal type, uh, which are very opaque, and the transparent type. First, a few numbers to get a perspective. In our palette of 50 colors, 13 are earth colors, six are natural earths, seven are the synth synthetic earths, and four of those seven are of the transparent variety. Here's why I want to have this discussion with you. Five of our top 10 selling colors are natural earth colors, and only one transparent earth color is in the top 20. I think the transparent earth colors should be valued and used more than they are. Here's why. The natural earth colors available to us today on the industrial level, and I'm talking about ochres, sienas, umbers, are not as transparent as the earth colors that were mined in pre-industrial revolution times. Things have changed. 200 years ago and before, a major consumer of earth colors were artists. Earth colors were prepared to meet their needs. Now earth colors are produced primarily for a different customer, the people who color concrete and stucco. Artists valued the very beautiful transparency of the natural earth colors, and concrete workers want greater opacity. So the earth colors that come to market are mined from deposits that have greater opacity. But we have a great option at our disposal, and that is the four color range of the transparent earth colors. They are glowingly transparent. Here is a detail of a, of a Rembrandt, and a swatch of a transparent earth orange. They look strikingly similar, don't they? I hope you find this information interesting and valuable. If you have any questions, you can email me at robert at conservationcolors.com. Thank you.